10 St. Petersburg is the place to be for indie drivers, race fans, and frankly, anyone. Yeah, and that's uh, where we find our Sean Daly. Sean, I was there yesterday. It was a fantastic day yesterday. Today's going to be even better, though. People are still talking about your star sighting, John. There's <laughs> buzz that John Thomas was here. There's some autograph hats, some chests. Um, yes, well, I, I, yeah, I, I left them there. 120,000 people are expected this weekend at what has become one of the premier IndyCar events in the world, let's say, the entire world. And you know, there's a lot of screaming girls are gonna be here today, but it's not because Justin Bieber's in town, it's because this young man is here, Zach Veach, the prodigy, 17 years old and already a master of the wheel. How do you do it? You're amazing. When'd you start doing it, anyway? Man, you're really blowing me up here. I gotta do good I know. this I'm gonna week, bring you now. down, though, about halfway through, I'm gonna bring you down, and then bring you back up again at the okay. end. Okay, okay, we like that. But yeah, I started racing go-karts when I was 12 years old. Yeah. Then once I was 15, I got a shot to drive for Michael Andretti in open wheel. And three years later, here go -karts I Go-karts to Andretti? I think you skipped a couple <laughs> steps. But CNN just named you one of their most intriguing people? Yeah, it was a real honor for us because we wrote a book and we're doing so much for anti-bullying and no texting while driving. So, oh, yeah, right, right, you know, right. I'm using racing as a platform to get out to other people and just show the world that drive safe and uh, be nice to everyone. Tell me more about the, the, about the, like, yeah, the no bullying thing. Well, I'm part of the no Team Noble, which is a na nationwide campaign of getting kids to submit videos that can win prizes about saying they're standing up to bullying. Yeah. And uh, that's just showing kids that might be a little too shy to stand up or say, hey, I'm getting bullied, that it's all right, you know, and that you can change someone's life by just helping out. Right, and because you're not prodigious enough, you've rubbed it into the rest of us mere mortals and you've written a book. Yeah, uh, when I first got with Andretti, I always got the question, what advice do I have to give to kids? And after another time or so, I was like, well, why not just write a book? So All I right, and what's the name of the book? 99 Things Teens Wish They Knew Before Turning 16. Give me two of those things. Always follow your dreams, never let someone stand in your way, and um, don't text while driving. Huh? Zach Veach, you know, I'll tell you. Ladies, you think he, he, he's a good-looking dude, but he was just asking me where um, Vanessa uh, Hudgens uh, uh, yeah, uh, the, uh, and Selena Gomez are hanging out. <laughs> Beach, you animal. Anyway, he'll be racing today at 1 o'clock, right? Right. Come on down. Uh, tickets start at $20. Uh, qualifying races start at 8, and then the real races start at 11. There you go. ABCActionNews.com. Check it out. Sean, thanks a lot. Hey, the highlight of the IndyCar Series, obviously, is Sunday afternoon. you got to join us uh, for live coverage of the Honda Grand Prix starting at 12.30 p.m. right here on ABC Action News. After being turned down by more than two dozen classmates, a Minnesota teen found an unconventional prom date thanks to Twitter.